Even though we're stuck at home for a little while longer, there's no need to let yourself go. Sarah Bielfeldt, owner of Expressions in Gibson City, is joining us now, and she's got some tips to help us look and feel our best, even in the middle of a pandemic. Hey, Sarah, thanks for being with us. Hi, Heather. Thank you so much for having me today. The salon's a little quiet, so this is a perfect time to actually get a chance to see the end of my salon, which is the boutique. Well, yeah, and so you've got some great tips to share today from yes. skin to hair to a little bit of fashion. So for those people who uh, may have spring break feeling a little pasty, you got some uh, something to help. I sure do, Heather. Um, I've been reading a lot of social media while I've been home a lot more with the kiddos. And what I've been seeing uh, pretty much all across the board is that a lot of people are starting to feel a little down in the dumps. We've had some dreary weather. Um, we've been stuck inside. So I know what makes me feel better about myself, and that's a little sun-kissed glow. So what I have here today is one of our favorite self-tanners here in the salon. It's um, a self-tanning lotion called fake bake one thing you may want to know about fake bake is it works the best if you first at home use a exfoliator so a brush or an exfoliating mitt or anything of that nature will really get your skin in good shape to put the self tanner on and then it's super simple because all you have to do is apply the gloves which are in the self tanner uh, box and apply the self tanner just like you would any other lotion it's amazing what a little sun-kissed uh, will do for you. Definitely. Um, one last hot tip I have with it is I try to apply it on one section at a time. So say my one leg and then the next leg. And once I get it on my entire body, I like to put a little bit of our Vasu oil over it. What this is going to do is it's going to make sure it isn't splotchy. So if you put a little bit of a, a light, lightweight moisturizer over it, um, it's going to help to make sure it's evenly placed and then it will dry and it'll last you about a week or so. Um, but you'll just have that nice sun kiss glow, that vitamin D feel that makes you feel a little bit better. Yeah, okay, we should be taking care of our skin as well. You've got a mask yeah. there to share? I do. So, um, again, while we're at home, we've got a lot of stress going on. Um, so some of our chemical balances come into play. And what I would recommend to kind of help your face during this time is a nice probiotic mask. Image Skincare has an awesome probiotic mask that's going to use charcoal cleansers to cleanse your face of anything that's kind of built up on it. And then it's going to use a yogurt-based probiotic, which is going to help to um, balance out your skin. It's going to help to make it feel shiny and fresh. And then they have um, a... Uh, daily tinted moisturizer that you can place after you wash the mask away. This is going to give you that uh, moisturizer, that SPF if you're doing PE outside with your kiddos, but it's also going to give you the glow that will match the fake bake self tanner. Fun. Okay, something else yeah. fun. Fashion. Yeah. Looks like you've got a lot of fun looks there behind you. I sure do. And I feel like we've all been at home for. 20 some days at this point we got another 29 to go and so we can't do athleisure every day i love the athleisure don't get me wrong but today's spring trends are all about comfort anyway so feel a little bit better at your, at, about yourself at home whether you're working or you're hanging out with your kids and try out a nice pair of uh jeggings these jeggings in particular have a nice stretch to them so they literally feel like you're still in that athleisure, but they're going to give you a nice trendy look at the same time. Nice. We also have um, some mom jeans. These are another great trend right now. Um, these are going to be a little bit more distressed, but again, you can just see that stretch in those. So again, you're going to have that nice feel of athletic wear while you're at home, but you're going to feel a little bit better about yourself because you're going to be a little bit more trendy. Yeah, I have seen memes going around that are saying, you know, every once in a while you may want to try your jeans back on to make sure yes. <laughs> you're still fitting. Yes. And having a little stretch is really important. Exactly. To top off the jeans, I would definitely top off any of the jeans with a little bit more of a blousey top. There again, if you've had a couple extra home baked cookies, it's not going to matter because <laughs> you just kind of blouse it out and let it go. Expressions Boutique, particularly, has a lot of these styles. 
kind of similar to the one I have on. They're in nice, bright, springy colors. This is another one. They're really easy to wear. They're flattering for every single type of body and whether you want to tuck it in or you want to leave it bloused out you're going to look really nice for the day but again have that comfortable feel for yourself well i love the sleeves on that one those are cute yes. little accent piece there yes thank you okay so something new and exciting you're getting ready to launch a new website tell me about it Yes, so we are probably going to be able to launch our website within this next week. Again, with the salon being closed, we're able to go ahead and work 100% on online sales and boutique website, which has been hard for me to find the time for. But I'm right there near the end, and the entire boutique will be found on www.expressionsbysarah.com. And there you'll be able to order online, put your item in the cart, and we'll ship it right to your door. Wonderful. Well, exciting things coming out of being shut down and quarantined for a little while. Definitely. Okay, so Sarah is in Gibson City, and she's also on Instagram and Facebook, and she's going to have a brand new website that she just mentioned, and we'll have all that information as well as links at CILiving.tv. Sarah, thanks so much for joining us. Thank you so much for having me. I was glad to talk with you.